High school football games are the biggest event on a Friday night in Texas. In the small town of Prosper, one family's story is making a mark in the town's history. The stadium actually, uh, the only thing around it was uh, a farmland. I mean, there was, there was no field house, no, uh, no Reynolds, no MPF. Jeff Harrison, a former member of the Prosper football team from class of 1993, played in the first game in Prosper's Eagle Stadium. Well, it was a, it was a new stadium at the time. Uh, we had our old stadium was I think it was three decades old, I believe, so it was very run down. So it was exciting. Uh, the the town, the whole town, was excited at the time, and um, as well as the the school and the players, um, student body uh, was all excited about it. Jeff's son Dylan Harrison is a senior who played in the final matchup at the stadium. Especially this being my first year in varsity, I always remember coming to the games, and then playing in the last one was especially cool. But yeah, I do think it's been weird. I'll probably go to games in the future. As Prosper has become over 20 times the population it was back in 1991, the stadium has become overcrowded. However, next year, everything will change with the opening of a new stadium across from Frontier Park. The um, population of the town at the time was 1,000 people, so uh, wasn't a whole lot of people to come to them. Well, when I first found out, that kind of got my mindset to where I need to make it special, make it one to remember. And um, I wanted to make him proud, of course. And towards the end of the game, when I saw the clock ticking down, I realized, I mean, that's it. There's, I mean, there's no more. This, we're probably never going to walk on the field again. As one chapter at a 28-year-old stadium comes to a close, another chapter begins with a new generation of players. Reporting for Eagle Nation News, I'm Annika Henke. Prosper.